How did you break your, your wrist? Let's start there. So I'd broken both wrists twice. So I fell down the stairs. I fell out of bed. I flipped over the handle bikes of uh, handlebars of a dirt bike. And I don't remember how I did the fourth one. Um, were you little or? Um, most of them were like 12 to 16 for the wrists because I went from being like 5'5 five five to being like 6'1 in like four or five months. And Whoa, 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 doing, say that again? I went from being like 5'5 five five my seventh grade year to being a 6'1 eighth grader. Um, so my bones just couldn't keep up with the lengthening. Oh, so goodness. anything I did was just immediately. And I like noticed a like, is this like a little bit of. Like a pectus excavator. Yeah, a little bit. And this is where my, like, issue that I'm coming here for kind of starts is... Yeah, I kind of... This is the first thing I see. Yeah, so when I hit that growth spurt, um, don't know why, but, like, my... I think it's my third or fourth rib, like, popped off of my sternum and never kind of, like, stayed in there. So there's a lot of, like, cartilage scarring in there. Can you show me, then, where it's pulling? Yeah. I guess you're going to have to take the... Can you see, like, oak semi okay without yeah. your glasses? If I pull this way, there's just a little divot right there, which is where, like, right where that rib is, like, pop, and I'll feel that. And the other side's just straight. Hold on a second here. This is just what I've been told. So okay. I'm just regurgitating. Okay, I yeah, no, 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 no. So, go ahead and pull. So, this is where you're saying it hurts. Yeah. Right here. Yeah. Now, let's do, do the same thing to the other side. It is straight. But see how you have natural... Yeah. You know... One of them's rounded and one of them's kind of at but, an angle. But, but now pull again. This way or this way? Yeah. Uh, so did you ever feel anything pull? Do you have any weakness in your pecs? Do you have weakness here? Not in my pecs, but with the scapula thing in my shoulders, I do have a little bit of weakness. Do you feel to... this weakness over here? Yeah, like so you... the weakness isn't when I'm going this way. It's when I'm going... Like, if I do, like, hammer curls, I'll feel like my shoulder kind of tip forward. Let me see your scapula, then. Uh, what, the way I do this is just kind of put both hands on the wall. Yeah. All right, yeah. No, I don't see any scapular winging. No, do, like, a push-up onto the wall. Like, push your... Yeah, and then back. No, I don't see anything. So, when I do that, I uh -huh. do it right, right like in underneath, there. like, right there. Oh, there's not there. Um, well, but well... It's... Um, I don't know what take a I couple steps back for me, like just right here. No matter yeah. how you do. Now, what I do notice is the pelvic. Yeah. Like you know this. I'm so short. Like it's rare that I feel short. <laughs> People are like how tall is she? Okay, so yeah, this this pelvis is tilted this way. Mm -hmm. So when it's tilted this way, it is going to make it harder to open up yeah. the hip socket. So how do we fix that? Cross your arms. You know, come up. This is where you should be more naturally. Now the pelt, now the hip will wing out. Okay. Okay. Take, take your hand behind you. Well, just kind of relax your posture. Lean forward. Do you feel how that tightens? Yeah. Now come back. See how they relax. Mm -hmm. Head back. They'll relax even more. Just, just your head. Look back. Is that as far back as you go with your head? I know. I. You never do this as somebody that's tall. <laughs> okay. I don't remember the last time I looked straight up. <laughs> okay. You need to practice looking at the sky some more, okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, but just look back, look back. Do you see how that even will relax this yeah. down here? It's all one chain, unbroken. Mm -hmm. One whole piece the whole way down. So if you look down, because everything is shorter than you, Yeah. see how that tightens? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, you've got to start. Now watch this. It will relax even more. Yeah. Okay. That's all that this is down here. Now the shoulders, let me see. Go ahead and what I'm gonna have you do is just do range of motion. Maybe I can see it, maybe I can't. The first one is we're gonna take both arms forward. Wait for me to be behind you. Go ahead. Nothing there looks fine. And down and all the way back behind you. Just kind of straight back. Okay. Perfect, nothing there. Now you're gonna just take both arms and go across. A little bit there. And again, do that one more time for me. Yeah, okay, I see what they're saying. It does kind of wing out a little more right here. Yeah. So what I'm gonna have you do now is just both arms up like that. Maybe, yes. 
looks fine there. Then this arm behind, like kind of reach up and touch this behind you. And then the other arm. You have more range of motion over here too, interesting. And then arm behind your back. Does that feel strange? Yeah, I feel like a lot of pulling down the front of my shoulder. Down the front? Yeah, like right here. Okay, then go ahead one more time. Behind you. Yep. It might be part of this peck again. Mm. That looks just fine, normal. Okay, so what I'm gonna have you do is you put your shirt back on again. This feels good. <laughs> You're like, huh, it feels bad to me. <laughs> is that real sore here? Uh, it's a little tender. I wouldn't say sore, but. Okay. Well, now here we go with the neck. Any neck pain? Not a lot. Just I work looking at a computer, so. Yeah. You do have something going on with the scapula. You do have something going on with this side. Is it life threatening? Absolutely not. Does it make your workouts a little tricky? Yeah. Yeah. And are you going to struggle with it? Yes. Yeah. Um, we're just kind of like a band-aid. We kind of mm -hmm. temporarily fix things, but as soon as you start going like all out again, yeah. it will slowly yeah. undo itself again because of this structure and the way that it's made here. I, it almost looks like an avulsion, like something got pulled off mm -hmm. because you almost have less muscle mass here than this side. Yeah. Like I can see when you do it when you do this, I see all the pec ripple up as it contracts. One, two, three, four, five. You know, all of them. Yeah. This side I just can't see it contract. So yeah. I don't know whether when it popped, part of the pec came off. Mm. You know what I mean? That that's almost what it looks like to me. Gotcha. If I had to guess, it looks like part of your, it popped up. Your muscle actually popped off. <laughs> just a theory. The only way I could possibly is like look for a ball up into here where the muscle retracted yeah. you know but what is it what is it life threatening no nothing nothing to be done you got plenty more fibers left yeah take a deep breath in <laughs> yeah hi free <gasps> Mm. There we go. I got it. If you ha don't get work done on this, it's like this very often. It is kind of a little bit of a shock. Yeah. You get used to it really quickly, though. <laughs> That's the good thing. Yeah. You're like, oh wait, can you do that again? The first time you have it done, it's it, you can feel tired afterwards. Okay, you can feel like weapon oh, beat up. You know, the body kind of doesn't know what to do with all of that in the beginning. But you're over it pretty quickly. Oh my goodness, look at all this though. Now I'm making the sound effects. <laughs> okay. All right, let's adjust it. Right here. You doing okay? Does that feel all right? Yeah, felt great. Okay. Toes. Healed, right? Yeah, hopefully. I'd be scared if they weren't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, they're going back in like one piece at a time here. Good. <laughs> mm, there we go. Wow. Is that the hip that you're saying? Yeah. Does that hurt when I lift it? It didn't hurt. It was just a little tight, like right in here. This is the one everybody just loves me for. <laughs> oh, quads. I could feel you flinching, and I'm like, hmm, something's wrong. Better ask him. Hold, hold. 
nobody likes this one. <laughs> this one's the mean one. Ah. All right, all right, all right. Give you a break. Okay, okay. Don't mean to make you. I know we're filming and all that. <laughs> I'll try to be. But see, look, it's not over here. Oh, wait, there's one up here. Oh, great. Great! Just wonderful. Foam roll your quad. You know, I did it once and it hurt, so I didn't do it again. <laughs> You gotta keep going, or you're gonna have to pay somebody like me to, to do it. <laughs> All right, okay, I'm gonna just kind of mobilize the rib here. Anybody adjust these? Anything. You know, this is the tighter side than the other one. You know, interesting. Mm -mm. Come on and sit up and face this one for me. Take a break, take a break. I don't know if I want this thing, let's see here. Let's see. Oh, just look at it, it just doesn't want to go back. You see that? It hates it. It hates that motion. So you're like, why is she doing it then? Well, because I gotta get some. That's all good, right there. That's it. Okay. Okay, uh, shirt off on your stomach. Do you need to clean anything? All right, deep breath in. Oh, yeah. Good. Perfect. I'll keep going, I'll keep going until I get it. Okay? Yeah. All right. That was great. Deep breath in. That one's already in, don't have to go more. Just making sure I got them all. These up here, somebody's really going haywire on there. Wow. Good, okay. The stomach is right there. Okay. Now it's time for Dr. Von to need to work. That was all the fun stuff. Mm -hmm. The cracks are fun. Doing okay with this? Yeah. This is how I kind of bust up all the concrete at the beginning. We've got all kinds of gadgets in here. You just don't see them that often. Okay, and here we go. I know, I'm sorry, that's that shoulder. This is how far down it goes, all the way into here. You okay? Yep. Breathe. Breathe, breathe. Okay, I'm gonna move up. There it is. Okay, okay, give you a break. There you go. Doing okay? You got a you got a big block right here. I feel that. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. Oh, it's making a little more sense to me now. Okay. Feel that? We got one, two, three, and then it disappears. So right here, I'm gonna count back from five. This is gonna be the worst one. Mm -hmm. Okay, worst one, it'll be over. Five, four, three, two, one. Breathe.
come up here. I'm gonna push down, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> here we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. There it is. I'm gonna wiggle. Want me to stop? I'll come off. I'm kind of balancing here, <laughs> so. So I'm, when I'm on your ribs, it's hard to breathe. Yeah. So I'm kind of giving you a little break here. Give myself a stretch. So here we go. Here's the other side. Five, four, three. Kind of two, one, and zero. Okay. <laughs> Get them all. Good, good, good. Okay. Take a little bit of a break. That is intense. You okay? Yeah, there's a little bit of scar tissue right here. Doing okay, this is just scraping. Yeah. This shouldn't be too bad. It's still crunchy. Yeah, gotta get rid of it. Yeah, we hear all the crunchies and It's pretty bruised, it's, you know, it's bruising over here. It's pretty bright. A little more on this side than the other. Oof. Here we go. <sighs> Done. Better cap, let's just get the cap. Cap are the worst. Kind of like the quads. You want to come up on your elbows or anything? Mm -hmm. I can if it helps you. If, just to help yourself. Sometimes it just feels better to not be stuck in a hole. <laughs> you know, have more control. Yeah, that kind of helps with the pelvis here. It shortens. So I'm not pushing in across a taut fiber. So you know I can kind of get more into there. Yeah. You know, when they're pulled tight, it's harder to get down in there. a little my butt is I didn't think it you know be that tight <laughs> okay size has nothing to do with it <laughs> unfortunately I'm psych myself up there we go head back three that's it perfect stay there relax into it Whew. I got all kinds of stuff I can use oh, you're like not that again <laughs> Why did I tell her it hurt? <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna hold your leg to push up into it. Okay, so yeah, you're gonna lean. Um, I'm just gonna pull your arm up here so I can get a good grip. Then you're gonna lean your whole body back. Yep. Good. And, yeah. Finesse. <laughs> All right, so you're gonna come on up and sit up. Yep, and then you're gonna turn around and face her. Cause then we have your chest and everything too.
you know, I didn't do these. All right, arm behind your back. Excellent, good, relax that. Arm up and over your head. Now this is the good side. See, I'm just combing that. Mm -hmm. That's your good side. Let's do the other one. I think this is all we need right now. Head back for me. Head back. That shortens it. Yep. Perfect. Good. Relax. Some lovely bruising there. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm gonna stop on that one. Back and up. Oh, 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 sorry. Right there. Hold, breathe. <gasps> breathe into it. Kind of push around the elbow. Yep. Okay, that looks pretty good. So what I'm gonna have you do, I'm gonna wipe you off, and I gotta, I'm gonna check out your pack, okay? Right. And your arms are gonna kind of go out like that, because I gotta go up and out like that. Here we go. Just kind of seeing if I feel anything. Sorry. Grab hold of the hand. Good. Look, this arm can come down. I'm not quite done with this one. I don't feel much of anything. Feels good. Everything's smooth. Nothing's. I was looking for like a ball of tissue, you mm -hmm. know, like maybe it had popped off or something, but does it hurt real bad if I do this? No, it's real tender. It feels good. I'm not finding anything. I think it, you just sprained a rib, a rib head. It, they call it costochondritis. It's something like that. It's not really costochondritis. You just have a little bit of a dip here in the sternum, but it's not bad. Here, here, arm up. I know you could stretch it real quick. You bruise. I think you're okay. I think you can hold it. That's it's too far for my heart to kill me, but it's uh right there, so don't think there's anything wrong. I didn't check your pulses, but no, you're fine. If the 
only thing from my perspective that I see is this tightness across the back. Mm -hmm. So if I were going to work on you, we can try it. Let's try it. <laughs> Bend your knees, then our head back, and then arms up and over. See, he probably could do that no problem. That's our larger roller and yeah. more like firm. If you can do all of this without it popping like this. Yeah. This I, is one of the uh, exercises I did it as like at home PTs. I had a foam roller, but I put it vertical. I so understand. I, yes, uh, that's why we're doing it. Action. I'm trying to see if it's okay. But this one's just a, a little bit more of a fulcrum because the long one you get to cheat. Yeah. And this one is more of a, uh, a curve. Yeah. I want you to lay on it as much as you think you could. I'm putting a whole weight on it. First of all, now how we get off of it is you roll to the side. Roll to the side. Yep. Yeah. See, the, the manufacturer <coughs> made different sizes. Yeah. They're slight, but significant when you lay on it. Okay. We, I forgot to do all those. We'll just have a seat. We'll finish those. <laughs> I forgot. Sure. This is what you got to work on the roller with. Okay. You got to start getting this out and that's, that's a challenge yeah. for somebody your height it just is it definitely feels a lot easier to like go back like that like before you almost had to like push your hand into me for me to get into that position but now i feel like i can kind of just do everything's it everything's loose yeah everything so don't don't go home and mold this way i'll try don't go home and just be like hi dr roger i can fix me <laughs> no. yeah. you gotta it feels good to do this now no i want you to I know, but you want to go more this way. Yeah. Put your hand here and then like, can you do this and not move your low back? Okay, that's the goal. Put your back here. No, no. Now stick your chest out. You don't want to move this. You only want to be moving yeah. this. That is, it's, it's just um, not just because you're 6'4", it's everyone. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, I'm going to stop there, okay?